Hi, thanks for stopping by. You can see I'm in the middle of a quick uh, slide pitch deck here. We're going to get on with it. It should just be a few minutes. This is a pitch on why sending calendar invites makes sense at scale. Uh, we are 31 events in Calendar Snack. If you want to check out our technology, you can go to those URLs. Uh, at those URLs, 31 events in CalendarSnack.com, uh, we have demos here, as indicated here down the left, and then we have social channels here. The biggest one is YouTube at Calendar Invite. Um, check us out there. There's over 400 videos. So let's get started. Why send calendar invites? The overall argument is that email marketers send three to six emails per event to get you on a calendar when it's a promotion-based um, event. It could be a webinar, a seminar, coming to my booth, um, and or coupons for product uh, launches. So we are saying that that wastes billions of emails a year and costs millions of dollars. So we advocate using the upcoming events uh, page on your website so your customers can send calendar invites to themselves. We've invented that technology. And for more on that, you'll see here in a couple of slides what I'm talking about. And then if, in fact, you own an email list, then send permission-based calendar invites using our tech stack on AWS. So that means instead of um, sending out the four to six or three to four emails for the particular event or the promotion to send a direct calendar invite and if in fact you have permission to send so so quickly here here's our upcoming page uh as i talked about the upcoming page allows somebody to come to your website put in their email address and click one button and get the calendar invite in addition the email list works the same way that is batch driven. You load your events, uh, you test your calendar invitations, and then you send them out in batch. We collect all that data from the calendar invites in what's called the event organizer dashboard over here. That said, in detail, this is an explicit diagram on the name there. Clicking these buttons will generate the calendar invites. And again, we collect the data and we analyze it in Amazon. So specific to the one-click calendar invite to the bulk list, which we've invented on AWS, uh, we use something called the calendar invite server. That is a piece of technology that has APIs and workflows allow you the advancement of sending millions of calendar invites using AWS SES and AWS pinpoint technology for email marketing. This tech stack allows you to actually test the invitations here. And how they're uh, done is you go into the visualizer in the VIP list engine. You pick out which uh, calendar invite you want to send in a batch. You upload your list, and then that's the batch there. It's sent, and then you can analyze the data with our uh, collection engine and our visualization engine. So that said, at detail level, what happens with the customers is the customers will receive the individual calendar invitations, and then we collect uh, with a scalpel that data, essentially the calendar receipt information in our calendar snack master dashboard. That detailed customer data on a per event baseline is analyzed in our uh, AWS tech stack. So as we wrap up here, uh, the one of the key kind of concepts is the fact that the individual event organizer dashboards are just one user within that domain uh, universe. That means that user one, user two are using this piece of tech stack and the APIs to visualize the calendar invites, the data, and actually send them in automated fashion using the bulk engine or the upcoming uh, page insertion for the calendar invites. That means on a domain basis, we can gather all the user data into one large AWS calendar invite um, system database. So that's kind of a wrap up there. I uh, appreciate you stopping by and checking us out. And for more information, check out our socials. Again, thanks.